the one game on Saturday across the weekend. Here's a swing and a miss, and Tolles is down. He one pitch to Patterson. Lined up the middle into center field. It's an RBI single for Brandon Patterson. He continues to get it done early in this ball game, the same way he has all year. Payoff pitch. Swing and a miss, strike three. High fastball that Graham couldn't catch up to, and that's the second out of the inning. Jordan Russ can last out there throwing this many pitches. Here's a swing and a miss, strike three. Russ battles back. After falling behind 3-0, and he comes all the way back to get Bryant. Russ set to deliver the 0-2 pitch. Swing and a miss, strike three. Russ will leave the runner stranded at third, putting another zero on the board. Here's the payoff pitch. Liner, right field. It's going to get down. Two runs are going to score for Upstate, it would appear. Throw will be cut off, and that's exactly what will take place. Finally, they break through with the bases loaded on a two-RBI single in this midweek contest with a bases loaded opportunity. 0-2, grounded through the hole between short and third and into left field. Two runs are going to come around. Trailing runner will score. Spartans threatening with them loaded. Here's the 3-2 pitch. Patterson lifts it into right, backing up on it. His joiner looking up and seeing it come off his glove and land safely to the ground. It will clear the bases as Patterson stands up at second with a two-bagger, and the Spartans, for the first time in the ball game, have claimed the lead on a fielding error in right field by Joyner. An Atlantic Sun Road Series with Jacksonville after this game is complete. Sabatka will get... Omar to check his swing, what we're discussing at the plate. He has also played a very nice third base for Asheville. That bare hand play comes to mind earlier in the game. Samples takes care of him here, though, getting him to swing at the breaking ball high. And he becomes the second strikeout victim of the seventh inning. And the 2-0 pitch from Tabor to Bumgardner is delivered. Gaither, high chopper towards second. Only play is going to be to second base and both runs are going to come home to score as the Spartans take a 10-8 advantage. Pinch runner over at first for the Bulldogs is Andrew Madden and here's a ground ball to short. Greer goes a short route and that's how the ball game will end. Gaither Bumgarner nails it down for his first save of the year and the Spartans come from behind for the fifth time this season picking up a 10-8 victory against Asheville. We'll Brandon Patterson goes two for three with four RBIs and a run scored on a victorious night of baseball here at Harley Park. Brandon, you guys able to come from behind tonight and pick up your 12th win of the year. Yeah, we just had to come over that uh, that loss from uh, from Sunday, and I uh, just got to try to get some pitches that I could handle, you know, and put them to the outfield and, you know, hopefully get some RBIs. Says a lot about this team, the way you battled back. What was the mentality of the club when you were down 7-1 early? Uh, we just had to get pitches, and we just had to hit, you know, like we like we used to. Uh, the past couple games, we really haven't been hitting, you know, well offensively. So we just had to bounce back and, uh, you know, just play our offense. When you have a game, you really seem to be having a game lately. Talk about the way you're seeing the ball at the plate. Yeah, just trying to trying to get my pitches, you know, good counts and uh, seeing balls I can hit and just try to use the middle of the field. Uh, really trying to not do too much with the ball, just, you know, trying to keep my swing. How important is this, Brandon, when you get ready to head into a road conference series? Uh, it's good, you know, you want to keep the momentum, you know. Uh, I know Jacksonville has got a great team, but you just still want to build momentum. And, you know, anytime with the team, it helps out the team get started too. Brandon Patterson, sometimes in that DH slot, sometimes behind the plate, but wherever they place him, he's been productive for the Upstate Spartans. Spartans pick up their 12th win of the season, a come-from-behind victory tonight at Cleveland S. Harley Baseball Park. Coach, your team never quit in a contest with UNC Asheville. Well, that, that's true, so that's that's the upside. You know, I, I like the seven-run inning a lot. You know, we were kind of dead in the water at that point, and then when, you know, we gave them the run late, that, that made me a little nervous, but then they just, you know, came right back. So that, it's all, that's a good sign, and it's always good to see that. Brandon Patterson hitting the ball so well for you, Brody Greer big, Gaither Bumgarner, but I think the big thing is you finally broke through with the bases loaded tonight, able to push runs across. <laughs> well, you got to remember they helped us out right there, but but that is that's true. You know, when you get the bases loaded and uh, you know you got some guys out there, you really have to get them home, and we were able to get a couple of them in tonight. So, you know, that was another positive outcome. 
Share with the fans how important it is to have this kind of midweek win to propel you into the conference road series. Well, you know, I, I tell the guys every game is big. Uh, you know, I mean, we want to win every game we can. And, and uh, you know, the back and forth nature of that game right there, um, you know, shows a little uh, perseverance, uh, resilience, you know. And, um, you know, and you do hope that it creates momentum for a weekend. I mean, sure is a whole heck of a lot easier getting on the bus tomorrow afternoon to go to Jacksonville when you've won versus when you've, you know, thrown one away, which, you know, I feel like is what we would have done if we had lost that game. Well, thanks for your time, Coach, and congratulations. All right, thank you. Wish you guys the best on the road. You can follow the Spartans on this road trip. UpstateSpartans.com will have all this weekend's action.